Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I do unboxings, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, travel, home decor, and even the very, very occasional dash of Disney. So if you enjoy unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And that way you'll find out whenever I post new videos, announce giveaways, or go live. Speaking of giveaways, you will wanna watch this entire video because then you can find out how to enter to win your very own My Trove Winter Welcome Box, which is what I have to share with you today. As always, if you're already subscribed, thanks again so much for being here and welcome back. In case you haven't seen any of my other My Trove Box unboxings, it is a gorgeous quarterly home decor subscription. It is $199.95 per quarter. If you're able to do the annual subscription for four boxes up front, you save $100 right there. But regardless of what kind of subscription you do, I think it is well worth worth the price. The items that come in these curations are well made, they are gorgeous, they are timeless, they are classic. They are items that I hold on to even in my very, very tiny home, but I know that one day when I'm able to move into a larger home, I will still be able to use these gorgeous pieces. Now I do have a coupon code for you right now. It is NoelGC25 and that will get you an e-gift card worth $25 immediately as soon as you place your order. I'll leave all of the details for you in the description box below, but essentially you do have to remember to put that $25 gift card into your cart for that to work, but definitely use the link that I'll leave for you. I'll put the code down there as well. So that will work on this winter welcome box or any purchases that you would like to make. And I think she might have a handful of the holiday box, which is part of the quarterly or seasonal subscription. And that is again, $199.95. It is so beautiful you guys it's kind of the combination of the fall and winter seasons she did it as one big beautiful holiday box i've already gifted a few of the items to someone as a housewarming gift i'm holding on to the gorgeous serving platter and serving utensils because they are some of my favorite things that i've ever gotten from my trove box so if you've been kind of on the fence about it go and see if she has a couple of those holiday boxes left but what's great about the winter welcome box which is a one-time box it is not part of the subscription is that it is a little bit less in price and you get some of their greatest hits from past curations, which again, you can definitely use in your own home or you can break that up and give those items as gifts. And you guys will see some familiar items in this box because they are ones that appear all the time in my background right here. So my Trove box comes in a big brown box. It is so pretty. I think you guys probably saw in the thumbnail the gorgeous tissue paper. Everything is well packed, but in pretty much recyclable packing materials, which I definitely appreciate. And then right on top, there was this nice little sheet that tells us the QR code for the design magazine that she puts together, which is always really, really awesome. Good ideas, tips, tricks for holiday decorating, just decorating in general, how to use the items, gives us some information uh, about the makers behind the items. So let me just go ahead and read the little letter from Corinne. It says, we are so happy to have you join us on our journey to bring handcrafted and sustainable home decor goods made by master artisans to your home. In keeping with our social and environmental values, see below on how to access your company in my Trove Box online magazine, which is actually called Discover Delight Design Delivered. Love that alliteration. Inside, you'll find the latest news from our founder, styling suggestions for your 2021 winter welcome box items, a Q&A with our featured artisans, as well as some easy, entertaining, and timely decor tips. But what I wanted to really share with you guys is you can get some of the other items that have been in past boxes, as well as other items by those amazing artisans in the marketplace. So definitely check that out. And there is a code for that. It's MTB. 20 or MTB 20 and that will get you 20% off of the items in the marketplace. So you could definitely uh, take advantage of that $25 e-gift card that you're going to get with your purchase and then turn around and make another purchase in the marketplace. Just thinking about that holiday shopping, you guys, definitely something to consider. We do want to get all of those orders in. I would say probably no later than December 6th to make sure that you're getting everything in time to uh, gift it to your friends and family. Now on the 
the back it's great because while I do like to use the QR code to really go through that design magazine, just for the sake of time, I do like to just kind of look at what she calls the nitty gritty with the care instructions. And it does give us an overview of all of the items as well as the retail values on the items. So let's go ahead and dive in. Now you can probably tell I went ahead and pulled the items out of the box, but I didn't actually unpack the individual items because I wanted you to get to share in that experience. So the first item that was a right on top once I opened up the gorgeous tissue paper, which I almost wish I could like buy the tissue paper because it's always so pretty. This time it was like a navy blue, blue floral. We have the uh, ubiquitous item in every My Trove box, which is their gorgeous jute shopping tote. I love these. I have used them at events. I use them on a weekly basis at the grocery store. What's really great about these, you guys, is not just the size, but I love these flexible and comfortable handles. So even when I have it packed full and it is super duper heavy, it's comfortable on my shoulder. The straps are long enough to go on my shoulder. And I think it just looks kind of chic in all honesty. It's a great way of taking things over to people's houses. If you're going to like bring gifts over, or if you're bringing like things, you know, if you're doing more of a potluck thing, this is a really useful bag. I didn't think that I would use them as much when I first got them. I was like, I don't know that I need to get more and more of them. I don't need, know if I need one in every single box, but I'm telling you guys, I'm always really excited to get another one because sometimes I'm nice and I share. So you can see how wide the foot of it is here. So you can definitely put quite a bit in there. I think it might even have the dimensions here. So it is uh, 16 inches long, 13 inches high, and seven inches in depth here. So really nice um, wide base and the, the handles have a 10 inch drop. They're made in India. You can actually um, wipe them clean with a slightly damp cloth, but they have just enough structure that they will stand up even empty. And like I said, I just really, really love the straps on them because they're so super duper comfy. So it says made of premium jute and lightly treated with wax coating for waterproofing. They're tall roll in hands for hand or shoulder carry, lightweight, roomy and sturdy. Absolutely. And the retail value on that is $15, which you guys, I think is really awesome. Again, I use them all the time. Didn't think I would, but I definitely do. All right, let's get into some of the fun stuff. So we got a decorative box designed exclusively for my trove box by Jaifa. Now I think this may have been, so it came all wrapped up like this in very simple paper. I think this may have been in one of the first boxes that I opened. And you guys, usually this box is featured right behind me, but um, Bernie, my little gnome has been taking over. And you guys have always asked me what's in the box. And right now there's just uh, like, photography props in all honesty, like um, jewelry stands and stuff in it. One day I'd like to have like more treasures in it. Now I'm probably going to uh, share this with someone else because again, I think the items in this box make fantastic housewarming or hostess gifts. Um, and I don't necessarily need another set, but you guys, it is so, so pretty. Maybe I'll switch it out because mine's gotten a little banged up. So this is how gorgeous it is. Again, I love the simplicity of it. You guys know I love my grays, but I love the two-tone. It's got this gold simple handle on the top. It is made out of wood. You can kind of hear that. I sort of love the sound of it. Stained in complimentary dark ash gray while its body is painted in a solid lighter gray for contrast. This decorative box with its painted metallic gold handle lends sophistication to any tabletop or shelf you set it on. I just think it's kind of great because I have all kinds of catch-alls and valets for my husband around the house, but even those tend to start looking a little bit cluttered after a while. So maybe the trick is to give him this box it's kind of a little bit smaller than like a shoe box and then I can just put the lid on it and and hide all of his mess so it says it is ten and a quarter by six and a quarter by three inches it's actually made in Chiang Mai Thailand I think it is so so cool I actually read the article in the original magazine about the artist that makes these they're 100% handcrafted so they might have some slight variations I actually love that when you look at it you can kind of see that it's like hand painted which I think is so cool um, so you do just wipe clean with a slightly damp cloth. I, I use mine all the time. It's not just for decoration. It's a nice functional piece. The retail value on this is a 125. And before you say anything, you guys, again, these are handcrafted. It's not mass produced. So you're not going to get those prices that you would at one of those discount retailers. These are quality items, but you're still getting them at a really discounted price because think about it. This winter welcome box is $99.95. So just in that single item, you are definitely getting your 
money's worth. All right, you guys, so let's go ahead. Of course, she couldn't leave us hanging. We had to also get the decorative tray that goes along with the box, which is uh, right there in my background. It always is. I used to have another tray back there, but I just love this gray one because one, it was a little bit bigger, and also I just think the gray looks great with everything. So you can definitely use this functionally. I think that it would look great um, on the bed, for example, if you wanted to have that, because it's nice sometimes to be able to put like a mug down if you're not like close to your side table, or if you're like me and you don't actually have room for a side table next to your um, bed. And then another thing that we use it for, because we don't actually have room in our very tiny home for like a big coffee table, because sometimes, you know, you want to eat in front of the TV in all honesty, we pretty much do that every single night. And so what we do is we'll put like a tray on the ottoman that we have for our couch and that provides provides us with a little temporary um, but still kind of chic looking uh, TV table tray. So let me see, I'm trying not to like tear the, the paper, but I'm gonna have to. So there's some of your ASMR, you guys. There's some of your unpacking experience. So I can never please everyone. Sometimes people are like, well, you should really unpack everything. And then some people are like, no, I really like experiencing the surprise as you unpack things and seeing how things are packed in the box. So there you go, you got a little bit of both. So here is the tray in that super simple gray. So it does match the lid of the box. And of course the box sits right in there. You can put it wherever you want in all honesty, but it definitely does fit on this shorter distance. It does have the nice handle so that you could use it. You can bring somebody their breakfast in bed or their milk and cookies at the end of a long day, or you know, you could also put it on your bar cart and have your uh, martini set up there. So it says, design with versatility and functionality in mind. This tray can be used with the matching decorative box or separately, of course. The neutral dark ash gray tone allows for it to be incorporated into any room or vignette of your house. I don't know if I'm fan enough to have vignettes in my house again dreams one day so the dimensions on this are 15 by 11 and a quarter 11 and three quarters by two inches so we give a little extra space so you know you're not trying to wedge that box in there it fits pretty nicely so I don't want to like have it fall out but maybe I'll just go ahead and show you how the lid fits so you can see here there is like a little inch of space there um, so the box uh, doesn't have to get squished into it so I love this tray you guys I use it all the time I know you see it all the time in the background but I do move it around the house sometimes it's a really easy way of taking sort of like a tablescape too maybe you like kind of do like a fun arrangement and you want to move it from your table to somewhere else and you don't have to like take everything apart you can just do it really quickly that way I think it's a really nice way of displaying books um, and again like this just kind of gave me like another like hard surface that I didn't have room for otherwise in terms of uh, floor space so we do have a one final item um, this had a value by the way you guys of another 125 so the box and the tray together have a value of 250 so that's already two and a half times the uh, the price of the entire winter welcome box and the final item it's funny because I realized I actually have all of these items these are not items that I've gifted to anyone else because I love them so much is this gorgeous just wool blanket so I actually went ahead and pulled the one that I have right off of my bed because that's how often I use it so it does come in this plastic but since I am probably going to gift this I'll go ahead and leave that one in there like I said I pulled the one off of my bed and you can actually get a sense of like how well it wears like it's not like worn at all so it's beautiful because it's in gray and I know I like gray yes I do so it has this really pretty sort of like herringbone um, weave to it you can kind of see it let me see if I can hold it up a little bit closer so you can see it almost has like a tinge of blue in that gray and then it has these gorgeous very simple tassels but I like that they're thick enough that they don't get tangled up which is really nice because sometimes when you get the really stringy uh, fringe I feel like it gets all knotted and doesn't look that great so these are thick enough that um, you can kind of just run your fingers through it and they're not gonna get tangled so this is a wool throw blanket it says when the winter chill sets in reach for this wool herringbone fringe throw blanket comfy and thick in weight it helps keep the draft at bay when you bundle up underneath absolutely so I have had this tucked away for a few months and I just recently had to go ahead and pull it back out of the closet and put it at the foot of my bed because I tend to sleep in a nightshirt and so at the beginning of the night I'm fine and towards the middle of the night it gets a little bit chilly because sometimes we'll sleep with like the door or the window open and so I just reach down and I pull that up and keep myself nice and warm it adds a nice bit of a uh, warm 
warmth uh, to our otherwise pretty like thin comforter because my husband tends to sleep a little bit hotter. So the dimensions are 59 inches by 67 inches. It is 75% wool, 15% nylon, and 10% polyester. So it's not just totally wool, but it has that warmth of wool, which is fantastic. It is designed in the U.S. and it is woven in Madhya Pradesh, uh, India. And so it does say that dry cleaning is the best. I think I maybe did that once, but I, I honestly, because I'm just using it on top of my comforter, haven't really had to wash it because I'm not using it like in front of the TV and spilling things on it. So um, just kind of fluffing it out usually works pretty well for me. The retail value on this huge blanket, you guys, there's like no way I could show you how big it is is $130 so all of the items are over a hundred dollars in value except for of course our lovely jute tote so again you are getting a fantastic value it's like over $300 on a $99.95 box you can of course use that code which is Noel GC 25 and you will get another $25 e-gift certificate that you can then use in the marketplace or on another box if you wanted to send the entire collection to a friend or family member I think this would be a really impressive holiday gift to someone. So let me know what you think about it, maybe what your favorite item was, but I know again, a lot of you have asked me about that box and that tray because I have them back here all the time. I might as well put the blanket on the foot of this bed even though nobody really sleeps in this bed <laughs> these days except for when we have guests over. Now, you probably wanna know how you can win your own. So super duper easy as usual. You do have to be 18 years or older. You do have to have a US mailing address this time around, you guys. And this is not in any way associated with YouTube or Instagram. You have to be a subscriber of my channel. It doesn't have to be publicly because usually what I'll do once I do use a random number picker to select the winner, I will just email you and you can send me a quick screenshot showing that you are subscribed to my channel. In addition, you also have to be subscribed and following me over on Instagram as well as my Trove box. So if you're also interested in just kind of following my Trove box in general, Corinne is really fun. She does all kinds of reels and stories showing you how to do different decorating ideas and also kind of keeping you posted on fun sales that are happening with my trove box so you might want to get on their mailing list as well but again for this particular giveaway for this winter welcome box all you have to do is be following my channel here on YouTube and then following both of us over on Instagram and then you also have to fill out the Google form that I will leave linked below as usual most of you kind of know the drill and I'll just use your emails like I said to go ahead and contact the winners and then the box will actually be sent directly by my trove box to one of you to enjoy so let me know if you do have any questions in the comments below I would love to hear from you Corinne would love to hear from you and we look forward to seeing what you guys think about this winter welcome box with some my trove box greatest hits I hope you enjoyed this video if you did please do give it a thumbs up that would help me out a lot and I'll see you all very very soon in my next unboxing